Welcome to the world's first review of uh, the High Vision Android laptop, which is uh, for sure the cheapest Android laptop in the world. Uh, it's a 7 inch screen. It is running an R9 processor by Rockchip. Is there Rockchip 2808? And it is like crazy cheap and it's running a real Android operating system which is really fascinating to see and I'm going to show you right now how fast the browser is and you have to consider that uh, right now I'm using a uh, MiFi to do the whole um, Wi-Fi access so it's not the optimal conditions but I'm going to go on my website right here I click on armdevices.net from the Google search and you can see how few seconds it takes to load my site and you can consider that my site has uh, a lot of of um, YouTube YouTube embeds, it has a lot of big pictures like um, the Apple A4 processor picture and and all these um, uh, what's it called the uh, YouTube embeds right there but I'm going to show you that the YouTube embed is not yet working so if I click on it uh, if I click on the play button right here it's just gonna say um, no YouTube support that is because um, there is some kind of uh, official flash support in Android which is not yet available but let's go on this big website engadget.com and still uh, consider this is loading over a MiFi adapter so it's not it's by far not the fastest because this device does have an Ethernet port so I could have if I did if I wasn't in a hotel I could have uh, used Ethernet to access uh, like full speed internet might have been faster than this but right now I'm showing you that this is totally usable over MiFi it's totally usable internet access I have to throw pages up like this to to scroll and throw them back on the side because that's how uh, the Android browser is is optimized not really for a mouse pad it's not really optimized for that and it's not um, like the button for example F6 is menu this is uh, uh, no, this is menu button if you push F7 you get the contextual menu uh, if you push uh, 6 you get uh, to exit and here you get back to to uh, this is the menu button well I'm not sure but they, they have some some shortcuts that they have done with F6 F7 and escape buttons so there there you go back to the Android uh, and I just open the notifications bar and I can go here on the program menu so you can see that there are all these applications that have been um, uh, com like customized by Rockchip and by High Vision where they're supporting even some 720p video playback which I'm going to show you right here this is playing a 720p 9 megabit video baseline profile that has the latest version of Android uh, that is uh, available for Arcos. Which well, there you have it. It's not super smooth because it's a 9 megabit. It's a very high bitrate 720p video, but it does support 720p video. And uh, then they have, for example, they have installed this and App Store, which is an alternative to the Google Marketplace. Uh, it would be of course much better to have the real Google Marketplace on this device which I'm sure you can hack onto it but um, uh, it would be optimal to have real uh, Google support for laptops so I'm looking forward very much looking forward to hear what Google is going to say about support of Android on the laptop form factors like this because this laptop in theory could be sold for as little as hundred dollars to distributors um, which High Vision is not going to be happy um, to hear me say because um, they like they don't want people to know how much it costs. But this laptop is cheap and it can be made for very 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 cheap. It can be made in China for less than a hundred dollars. That is the basic basic information right here that there is to say, and this is just completely amazing that uh, you can get a full laptop, which with with most importantly with a pretty pretty smooth. Um, uh, uh, browser which is the most important application as you can see right here um, if I click on this story right here let's see what happens one two I'm still over the MiFi access huh you have to consider three there it loaded the page so it is quite usable 
and you can scroll down to read all the comments and it says go Dell and of course Dell is a copy uh, is a competitor of the Arcos 5 in internet tablet so here let's go on some other website if I go on on the news and let's open this right here I'm going to open Google News which I just clicked on there I just needed to close something or something so there is Google News and you have the latest uh, Google News the tourists and Tony Blair um, and uh, we click there's some totally random uh, Wall Street Journal article I clicked and let's see what happens there you have it so it is loading the pages are loading um, the scrolling is pretty smooth I think and if if Google uh, would uh, tell us what's going on with laptop support so we know that we don't get these things that are supposed to be for, for touch screens huh? so we get real scroll bar and so we get another way to get to to new window than going through um, like a contextual menu like that we, we want to have we want to have a, a real way to go from one tab to the other which is a laptop way not where you have to you know do this which is really made for pocketable Android devices but anyways this is a really smooth and I'm gonna load one more website New York Times this is a really smooth browser right here uh, New York Times dot com and which is really the most important thing that I wanted to show that it's loading websites over a MiFi adapter 3G MiFi adapter on an ARM 9 powered laptop rock chip 2808 processor and uh, the, the experience is much faster than I would have expected so imagine if you have an ARM Cortex processor um, it can be like even much faster than this so it's just uh, I think it's completely amazing actually that you have this kind of speed on a such a cheap such I've been testing these for the last couple of years and they've been running Windows CE or they were running some kind of crappy Linux but this is uh, this is Android and it really helps for the browser it really makes it fast and I I think this browser is cool and uh, considering this kind of laptop can be made for peanuts basically it's really really cheap so it's gonna be really fun to see the OLPC use ARM processors as well so there you have it cheap ARM pad laptop the world's first review of the Android high vision uh, laptop thanks for watching